Hi folks, it's Sean Eisman from LastChanceOnRestore.com. Just a quick little update. We're standing behind or beside the 1949 uh, Chev half-ton pickup truck uh, short bed and we've done quite a bit of uh, progress on the chassis and the braking. So just wanted to share with you in terms of suspension and braking you know, a little bit of a status update. So what we have done is we had the backing plates and everything removed from the rear brake. So all this was disassembled. Everything was sandblasted and painted. And then the axles were removed. The rear diff cover was removed. Um, you can see other than the dust, this all looks like brand new. You can see this is all nice gloss black with the exception it's so dusty in here. So this looks really, really nice, I think. Um, so we've got all the nice gloss black. On the inside, we've uh, taken the axles out um, the uh, the fluid that was inside the rear diff housing um, was really nasty in terms of smell and just really tired and, and needed to be cleaned out and uh, fresh gear oil put in. So we went ahead and we did that. We removed both of the axles, so uh, both sides came out. We replaced the seals and the bearings. The bearings were all worn and rusty and uh, would not uh, service this vehicle very well. So we've replaced the seal um, and new bearings and then reinstalled the axles with the new clips and then we put new fluid in and then we've completely rebuilt the braking system. So now we have everything cleaned, we have everything painted. Um, the studs have been redone so we have all new clean studs nothing is cross-threaded and then all new hardware in detail so you can see we have the uh, special wheel cylinder this is the older generation or older style wheel cylinder that is factory correct for an early 49 truck we have all new hardware which is really hard to find now we have all the new hold down springs um, and our, our levers, our, we have the new cotter pins, so you can see everything is done correctly and it's as new. So we have new shoes, um, all new pivot points, all new hardware, and you can see from both sides. When you come to this side, you can see we have a brand new uh, parking brake cable. We have a new housing for the cable, and you can see the new spring, new adjuster. So essentially, everything you see here is brand new. And then we also have uh, all new brake drums. So the drums uh, that were on this or came with this truck, they obviously were sitting for a really long time, um, and they were under specification. So I don't think the camera can pick it up but they have a, a diameter stamped in and a minimum. So there's a part number and then they have uh, a minimum thickness that's permitted for safety standards. So what they do is they measure the thickness here of material and that determines whether the drum is safe for the road or not. So a lot of guys will just cheat. There'll be some surface rust in there. They'll scuff them a little bit. They'll say it's good enough. They'll slap them on, put a little bit of paint on and just say everything is new. But here we want to make sure everything is within spec and done properly. So the drums were actually under and would not be safe to drive on the road. So these are new drums and they only come in an unfinished cast. So then what we did is we lightly sandblasted them, we degreased and cleaned them, and then we painted them with a high grade quality paint. So with, the, with them painted you'll see the inside, it's all brand new casting and all the metal is new. So these will last probably lifetime of the truck now um, and they are well within spec obviously because they're brand new. So the only other thing that I wanted to point out at the rear, uh, we have the new flex, um, flex line here um, for the brake and we've just got it lined up here with some tape. We're getting ready to run the new nickel copper line from the front to the back so we'll have all new line and then we'll have it done properly from this side to the other wheel. So we've got new wheel cylinders, everything is basically new here. And then in terms of the suspension, as I mentioned in an earlier video, we were working on the uh, lever shock system and these have all been redone now and we have new hardware and now they are installed too. So the next step for the rear of this 49 truck will be to install the drums, make sure we adjust the shoes properly. 
there's some rubber plugs that are on back order, inspection plugs. So once they go on, we just have the, uh, the copper line to do. So just a quick little update, rear brakes, everything's brand new. Uh, this is the 1949 Chev truck. I'm John from lastchanceautorestore.com.